What's up, man? Pot to the king of YouTube. Always on the scene. I'm right up here in Harlem right now. Ran into this brother whose videos I've been watching all weekend. I'm inspired by his page. I happened to meet his brother a few months ago. I interviewed him back in June, and then I lost my phone. It's a Blackjack 2, just in case it pops up. I had some very important videos and data on it that I consider precious. So I'm up here in the black man's mecca, and regardless of the forces of gentrification that's sweeping through the neighborhood, yeah. it's still our mecca. There's still a fault line under deep invasion. under here. You mecca, know what I'm saying? Yeah, the mecca, the mecca is under invasion. You know what I mean? They done split up in this motherfucker. They're trying to change the frequency out here because they know that if they if they topple this, this is like if people study the uh, Moorish Spain. This is Granada, you know what I'm saying? This is Al Andalus right here. This is our basically, this is our, this is our hub. You know what I mean? So they figure if they infiltrate the hub and change the frequency, it's gonna fuck up the whole black nation worldwide. You know what I mean? I ain't even talking nationwide. It affects the world around the world, but never fret, never worry. The brothers is out here holding it up. You know what I'm saying? We turning the frequency up to levels that they can't even reach. You All know right. what I'm saying? So right. when they come up here, they already feel what's going on. They know that they ain't walking in a cemetery with a bunch of dead people out here. Okay. They know that people are, they know that they got people awake. You know what I'm saying? It's some, it's some live energy. So okay. they trying to tap into that, but you know. We ain't stressing that because we got plans, you know what I mean? That's true, we're man. We're on the bigger thing. Nation building is the key word yeah, right yeah. now. Word is word Yo, is I going. just want you to know I'm honored to be in your presence. Let the people know I'm how to find you. I'm honored to be in your presence, brother. Yo, I'm on um, YouTube. Uh-huh. It's YouTube slash Filthmore 08, P-H-I-L-T-H-M-O-O-R-08. That's okay. my whole name. People are like, why you say that? What's, what's that about? My name is Philip Thomas Moreland, you know what I'm saying? 08. I'm not... Ashamed of my original name. It all mm -hmm. means something. I done did the knowledge on each name. It, it, it relates. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. Especially my last name, Moreland. That's of what course, I'm here to, to bring about. Is a Moreland. So you know, and you could translate that to a black land for my emotional uh, disturbed people who can't, you know, who can't put one and two together. So um, you know, that's my page. The website is coming soon, notalestv.com, notalestv.tv, and um, you know, that's that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? We taking advantage of this whole cyberspace thing, making that's this right. our new grounds of media. The the, the voiceless uh, have gotten a voice. You know what I'm saying? We able to broadcast so. straight into your living room from wherever we at, showing you, not talking about it, uh -huh. not giving you past preferences, references and all of that. We giving you the now to show you that the gods are here now. You That's know what right. I mean? And then if, if you do the, the history and the knowledge on the gods from before, the people that you see now, you should be able to relate who's that. You know what I'm saying? It's a whole litany of us. It ain't one person. It's a whole bunch of us just waking up and letting ourselves be right. known. And it's not just Harlem. It's all over the world. Brothers is turning on their computers from the side of their living rooms in different states, different countries, and they stand up saying I'm here I'm, 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 I'm arrived I'm That's here right, I'm, man. I'm, I'm in the building you know what I mean and people is reacting to that you know what I'm saying so you know all right I want to ask you a quick question yes sir. Reference to, like I said I've been watching your videos all weekend thank you sir right and um I've been dropping mad comments so yeah check it when you get a chance there was something there was a, a, a um, Bobby Hammett Bobby Hammett um um Gosh, why is the word Bill spelling? Valentine. Yeah, but there was but a, the, a, 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 a stimulus, a, a economic, stimulus, right? Stimulus, package. right? Now I want to ask you something about that. There is a verse in the Bible that does say that in the last days and times, Michael would stand up for his people. All right, and I, I, I guess they touched now, on that subject. Yeah, I want to get into this. Prior to the passing of Michael Jackson, you had people from the outside throwing rocks. They living in glass houses, glass mansions, throwing glass palaces, throwing rocks. You dig what I'm saying? Trying to say that Bill Valentine and Bobby Hemmett were promoting a brand of information that they label mumbo jumbo. Okay. And they also call them ghetto scholars, right? But when you go and study Bobby Hemmett, and all the way from March 08, 
he started coming forth and saying, listen, I'm in contact with the spirits, and they're telling me that there's an archangel, Michael, okay. about to arrive. Okay. And when the, and he didn't just say that the angel was arriving, he said the angel is coming to bring abundance to the people. That's what's up. Feel me? <laughs> he said that the angel is coming to bless the people with prosperity. And he ain't say the archangel Gabriel, he didn't say the archangel Jesus, Ra whatever. Raphael. He ain't say Raphael, he ain't even say Heru. All right. He said Michael, Mikael. Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So this was months ago. So then, as, as he continued to do his radio <laughs> interviews and build up for this lecture that he was doing in New York, he kept reiterating the fact that the angels are coming, the angel is coming, the angel is going to descend to bring forth, you know, to, to, to signify, you know what I mean, the times that we in. Okay. The Coincidentally, of the Michael Jackson passed on early, late June. And everything that Bobby Hemet was talking about started coming to fruition. All right. All of a sudden, money started coming out of the sky. You feel me? And I did the tape. I didn't want to pull out the bankroll. Feel me? Because, you know, we, we ain't got to brag. We yeah, people don't proof. like seeing money. I, I'd rather just talk about it. I had the God sitting next to me so you could see the energy that we was manifesting. I ain't had to show you. You knew what it was. And I showed you 10 minutes full of footage of of inventory of product that we was all out here moving you know what i'm saying and that shit happened like this you know what i mean a week before that brothers was out here scheming on each other like wow. hurting you know what i'm saying nobody was really eating like that you know what i'm saying and then that that piggyback veggie veggie back and so a whole bunch of <laughs> other opportunities for people to begin making their money making their economics because as we both know this mission that we on is gonna take a lot of paper. That's you know what right, I mean? man. Not it's just gonna spirit. take a lot of money because we got right. things to do. You know what I mean? We got these videos. They need production. We got these uh, this, these DVDs. They need to be around the world. We got uh, websites that need to be built. We got trips that brothers need to go on 30D. You know what I mean? Pitching, pitch us getting off the plane and Kim it 30, 40 deep, knowing what we know with the energy that we bring in there. That's right. Huh? Yup, we're going to pass. With gonna the cameras sweep. running up on the pale A-Rabs, like, what's Yeah, poppin'? man, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So we need to fund this operation that we got. And it's for the future. It's for the babies, it's for the women, it's for the mothers, it's for our ancestors. You That's know right, man. That's so right. So all of these doors are starting to open up. So this biblical verse that was talking about this archangel, Michael, who is the highest of angels, is right and exact. If, if, if you pay attention to who Dude was and the music that he was doing and what his purpose for real, for real, not the surface shit, not his personal he life, not his the Illuminati. huh? He started fighting against and speaking, exactly. out, speaking out, and that's probably why he's gone now. Oh, no, nah, that's why he's gone now, you feel me? They knocked him off. And there's the brother, I see the Duke of Tears, man. Said, excellent lecture called The Contradiction and Cover Stories. And he's showing, he, he's giving, he's showing you all kind of shit. How the brother was with, how, how Mike was with the Arabs, but the Sheiks, the Sultans, you know what I mean? Yeah, the you high know, and mighty. The high and mighty, the ones with the secrets, first and foremost. Because you must remember that these Sheiks, these, these, these people in Saudi Arabia, these people in Egypt, these people in Sudan have intricate secrets, mysteries. We talk about the Pope and the Vatican. These brothers have history, mysteries, information, answers. Slave about records. Us. Yes. They know who we are. Especially the Moors. They know you who we me? are. Yes. They will tell you a lot of shit. They you know, know who saying? we are, fam. Yeah, what? so, you know, he was with them. Then, coincidentally, he became Muslim. What did he find out? What did he know? You know what I'm saying? Then he was owning half, you know what I mean? It's so much shit that the brother uh, covered in this lecture. You gotta pick that up and check it out. Alright, I'm gonna break it down because you on nine minutes. But before we go, yeah. I wanna manifest something right now. I know you gotta answer your phone and all of that. Before you write back. Directly across the street. Alright. Yeah. Directly across the street, we got a building called Mart 125. Yes, yes. It's uh, technically abandoned. Economic warfare. Alright, now, in, the, in light of this. Arc arrival of this great Archangel Michael. Yeah, I like to manifest a prayer on behalf of my people that we can get that yes. and maybe get inside of that same building the biggest internet cafe known in the black world yes. and that we could get some 
technology training schools, maybe some solar power institutes, yeah, some, teaching some people how to produce. Like, like 20 max in there, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm we about to do a series where I'm going to further, I'm about to do a, a, a few lectures that's coming up that I'm putting together and I'm going to play a part in. The first one is going to deal with economic sovereignty. I'm continuing with that. All right. What I'm going to bring is economic solutions in this first part. I'm going to the brothers that's out here that's doing something, that's making money, that's, that's starting their own, that's already functioning with their own business. And I'm going to let them talk to y'all and explain to y'all all over the world what it is that y'all need to do to begin empowering yourselves and release yourself from the clutches of the crackers. Understood. You feel me? Then the second one we're doing is a lecture dedicated to all of the creative people within consciousness. The artists, the screenwriters, the playwriters, the actors, the actresses, the musicians, everybody, the graphic artists, and we're all, and, and, and the headline of that is going to be Phil Valentine, because if the people do not know, he is a master artist. Okay. You understand? So I'm going to have him try to invigorate and turn on this community because we have to begin translating all of the information and the stories we have into mythos. We right. gotta turn it into movies, comic books. As you can see with the Marvel Universe, they're taking their comic books and their mythos and they're creating a whole new reality on screen. They're telling their stories, so we're gonna start telling our stories like that. Understood. You I'm gonna I mean? snip it right here since we're a little past but 11 we minutes. That. We need that. Yeah, we need we that need mark, that man. Badly. You know what I'm saying? All we gotta right. fight for that. Them huh? niggas, that, that's, that's the surely sign of the economic war that they waged against us when they closed that down. Straight All like right. that. It, it ain't right. nothing to, you know, it ain't nothing to really like philosophize over. You know what I'm saying? They crushed us with that. All right. Understood, so. no doubt.